The White House convened a group of black Republicans on Monday and asked them to spread the word that the Trump administration is hiring. A source inside the meeting told Daily Mail.com that White House Chief of Staff John Kelly asked for resumes at the gathering that was billed as a briefing on tax reform. Kelly said Tuesday that he did say African Americans when he asked for the resumes, although he did make the ask. I said talented young men and women of any age that would be willing to come and serve the country for some period of time, he stated. The White House convened a group of black Republicans on Monday and asked them to spread the word that the Trump administration is hiring. Senator Tim Scott and Herman Cain, a former Republican presidential candidate and businessman were also at the meeting of about 30 African-American policymakers and business people. Gary Coe the point of the meeting was to update attendees on tax reform. But Kelly also acknowledged the administration's diversity problem in his comments. I went over and met with them, just for a few minutes, and I said we are looking for talented young men and women. I did say African Americans, I did say Hispanics, he said Tuesday. Kelly said he told the group how rewarding it is. I have done this my whole life nothing else, he said. How rewarding it is, whether you're in the military working at the White House or at the Department of Labor and said if you know people who are looking towards something that is very fulfilling were looking for really good people. A second person in the meeting said that Kelly admitted that the administration could do better at the higher levels when it comes to diversity. He did not say, we want more African Americans resumes, the person said. He did acknowledge the lack of diversity in terms of the lack of diversity at the White House, the person said. He said that they could do better in terms of their positions at the White House. He said that they want to do better and they want to get more people to serve in the White House House who are willing to serve. Missing from the meeting was Omarosa Manigault, the Director of Communications for the Office of Public Liaison, whose last day was supposed to be January. 20 Nobody from the White House, from the Office of Public of Liaison, acknowledged her, her absence or her former position. Kelly said that OPL has been restructuring for a while now and noted that there was not a person dedicated to black outreach currently, the person said. The subtle message was clearly Omarosa has been blocking this, clearly Omarosa did have any juice, and we want to make sure that the community of black Republicans from Access the Country knew that there was an open door to them. This was the first convening of black Republicans the White House has had, the person who is familiar with the Trump administration's outreach, said. What it showed everyone was the White House does care and does want to have these people at the table and that was a good thing. Black Republicans had complained that Manigault froze them out.